Hello guys and welcome to Norway Village Real Estate Market Report for condominiums. Today we are going to review and analyze the new listings for sale, units sold, new listings for rent and units rented on the third quarter of 2015 versus the third quarter of 2014. Let's see how we did. On the new listings for sale in the third quarter, we had an increase in 2015 of 9%. As well, the amount of units that were came up on the market for sale in 2015 and 2014 third quarter were almost the same. So this information is very is irrelevant. What we can see the big difference is on the amount of new units for sale on distress. Units in distress are units that are short sales or REOs. REOs are units already repossessed by the bank. We have only nine units coming up on the market for sale in 2015 compared to the 22 units came up on the market for sale in 2014. This is only indicating that in other village, as we go through the years, the market is becoming more stable. Let's see how we did on the unit sold. On the unit sold, we had a small decrease in the average lease price in 2015, as well as a small decrease of 9% on the average close price in 2015, and not only they were listed for less money and they were sold for less money in 2015. Very little for less money, but they were sold in a longer period of time. Meaning that on the average days on the market, on 2015, the, the average days on the market was around five days, compared to the 87 days average that they took to be sold in 2014. This is not negative information. This only means a stability again. Buyers are not so aggressive anymore as they used to be in 2014 and 2013. Another proof of that is that the units in distress that were sold in 2015 were only six compared to the 19 units that were sold in 2014. Let's see how we did on the rentals. A completely different story. On the new listings for rent, the average lease price of 2015 was increased by 6%. We had a 6% increase on the average lease price on the new units that were listed for rent in 2015 compared to 2014. As well, 182 units were listed for rent on 2015 compared to the 144 units that were listed for rent on 2014. We cannot overlook the fact that in 2015, in Norway Village, we had two new rental buildings coming up on the market for rent adding over 450 units to Norway Village inventory. We have John West Park Apartment located on the west entrance of the island with over 300 units, one and two bedroom apartments, and we have Mollas on the Bay with over 150 units with one and two bedroom apartments as well. Even though that we have this huge increase to the inventory of Norway Village, we were able to do good on the rentals. We had an increase of 11% in 2015 on the average lease price. We had an increase of 9% on the average price that they were rented in 2015. And not only they were rented for more money, that they were rented in the same amount of time that they were rented in 2014. If you would like to download a copy of these graphics and this report, please click on the link below. Thank you for watching and have a wonderful day.